Welcome to HawknessComics.com. These are all the new releases and books that are going to sell out for the June 25th, 2014 week. A lot of big indie books that we uh, know are going to sell out quick and potentially go up in value, like Ritual 3 Vile Decay from Alternative Comics. This is going to have a very small print run. And that might be the case also for 64-Bit Zombie from Fred Perry at Antarctic Press. This has been a series of one-shots based on the zombie theme. And Bonnie, number two, is back from Tim Yates at Blue Juice Comics. This one is going to sell out right away at Diamond. Amazing World of Gumball, number one, is one of the big releases of the week from Boom Studios. Many variant covers on this one aimed at young readers. Dream Thief is a new mini-series from Jay Nitz and Dark Horse, as is Emily and the Strangers, new mini-series Breaking the Record, also at Dark Horse. It's another big week for DC Bombshells, sexy female variant covers being released. Catwoman number 32 is one of them. These have been very popular and they're coming out every week in June. How I Made the World is a one-shot from How I Made the World Comics. This is going to be one of the smallest print-run comics likely of the entire year. Grab this one. And Cartoon Network Super Secret Crisis War number one from Louise Simonson at IDW features a whole bunch of their biggest TV characters like Powerpuff Girls, Ben 10, Samurai Jack, Dexter's Laboratory. And this one is selling out very quickly from Cartoon Network. Transformers Spotlight Drift, it, Director's Cut is a new one shot from IDW. And here's the big image comics of the week. Cowl number two is already sold out in advance of release at Diamond and follows the big sellout of number one from Kyle Higgins. And Dream Police number three from J. Michael Straczynski is a big one coming out. And here is the follow-up story uh, to the big sellout Invincible 111 that came out last month. Robert Kirkman is back with a new issue. This one's selling out quickly. And speaking of Robert Kirkman, he's got his brand new series, horror title, debuting this week, Outcast. It is sold out in advance of release. It's going to have a huge print run, but it still might be a big sellout. And uh, we ordered lots of this one. Saga number 20, always popular from Brian K. Vaughan, but this one, again, sold out in advance of release. So even with big print run, it keeps selling out. And Warren Ellis has got a huge print run on trees, but it looks like number two is going to sell out fairly soon. And Marvel brings us a new Hulk series from Alan Davis, debuting today. And Spider-Man Spectacular number one is a giant featuring four Titanic tales, including the Green Goblin and Kraven the Hunter. And one of the biggest sellouts of the past month was Brass Sun number one, and number two is out today from Ian Edgington. And you're going to want to check this one out for sure. Lots of rave reviews. And one of the books selling out the fastest this week from all publishers is Mighty Titan from Red Anvil, number one. You find this one, it's going to have a small print run. As is Alien Legion, Uncivil War. I heard that this is the first Alien Legion story published in like 30 years, written by Chuck Dixon at Titan Comics. And Rob Williams brings us number two of Ordinary. And this one was one of the hottest past comics of the month. Number one, selling out everywhere. So there you go. Lots of great books. You can order all of these at our website, hawknesscomics.com. Check out our weekly market reports at investcomics.com and comicsheatingup.net. Thanks for watching.